range prefers live chat for their customer service. Let's admit it, you're on your couch, you have an issue, you're on your phone, there's somebody popping up, you can easily um, ask their question instead of like picking up the phone, then you have to hear somebody who's annoyed or angry, it's like oh, him again. So it's really easier to just send your question online, <coughs> it, I guess, you know, less interaction, but the answers are usually fast and the clients usually don't have patience and they will wait maximum one, two minutes. Um, it's the world we're living in. Um, and it's less pressure for them to contact you by live chat. Normally they're anonymous, so you know, there's no pressure for them because they, even if they hate on you or they love on you, you don't really know who they are unless they actually tell you or they're signed in into their Odoo account, but that's another story. As I mentioned, the operator can multitask, talk to a person, and uh, answer another email for another client um, and can juggle between these two tasks. And it's an undeniable thread. I think uh, you've already experienced it in your customer um, journey with, you know, if you're on some e-commerce and you're not decided whether you want to buy a product or not, you want more specs, it's very easy to just pop the question, well, um, send your question in a pop-up. and. I know that uh, the, there's a huge trend going towards AI and probably will, I'm surely will go in that direction as well, but <clears throat> uh, clients do appreciate talking to a human. And if you do, do this properly, um, the, your retention rate uh, will be much higher and also your conversion rate um, will increase in the same manner. Uh, the second part that I want to discuss is the pre-sales. Clients like making informed um, decisions, and I think, as I already mentioned, um, you're in the same, uh, I mean, you're, you're interested in buying a new laptop, let's say, I'm pretty sure you do a lot of research, and it's more uh, in, you know, have a higher incentive if you go on the website and there's a pop-up and you can ans ask all your questions, you're not sure about the spec, maybe you want a discount. So talking to a human in real life can definitely help you take your uh, you know, a decision faster. Um, and about 44% of the online consumers say that having their um, question uh, asked uh, during a, well, a live chat session, you know, they're increased, the probability of the purchase is much higher. And uh, we've seen it also in our own company, There's, there are much higher conversion rates um, with potential clients um, because of live chat. And I will focus now on how has it helped us. There are three different areas, support, sales, and usability. Um, the fact that we can take care of issues on the spot definitely reduces the number of tickets that we can receive. Um, and you know, the, the rating is much higher because I helped you right now. You didn't have to wait for three hours, one day, two days for me to answer your questions. It was right now. Um, and also in the case of potential clients who are looking for answers, who are pretty lost in your product or uh, whatever matrix you have and they don't understand, uh, the decision making is um, much uh, shorter. In sales, as I was um, already mentioning the pre-sales, for Odoo, this is one of our best lead generators and the highest conversion rate around 10%. So imagine that today, I was online for a few hours, I created 10 leads, one of them will become a client. So it's a pretty good um, ratio. And also in terms of usability, uh, we use the feedback that we get from our visitors to improve the existing features and to come up with new apps. I will not tell you which one came because of live chat, but there are a few. And it helps us fix what's not working and improve what's already there. Now with a demo, I'm sorry I was rushing through this, but since there are only 20 minutes, I've uh, created here a simple uh, website just to show you how it all works. First of all, going back to the back end, I've, uh, this is obviously V13. Um, you see the live chat and I have the CRM, uh, one of the, the few apps that live chat is integrated with, social marketing, help desk. We'll quickly go into the live chat. I already created a channel I was mentioning earlier. You have different options where you can put what questions you wanna have uh, for your users. 
the channel rules. Here I mentioned earlier that you can choose the country where it shows up or you can choose the countries that you don't want to show up. You can also exclude uh, whether you want it a pop-up or just static on the side of your website. And here, um, for the traders in the room who don't use other website, um, as I mentioned, you can copy the snippet and put it in your website tag and use live chat if your website does not have it. Um, no strings attached, just saying. Um, here are the canned responses. This will definitely make your life easier if you have recurrent questions. Uh, it's very easy to create. Um, you just put your keyword here. Um, or do connect, let's say, come back next year. I will save and then I can immediately just use this in my conversation. Now, maybe if you've never used live chat, this looks pretty simple and it is simple, but very powerful. Um, as I mentioned uh, here, I'm in discuss. Before I move on, let's join my channel to join my live chat and I will go here. This is uh, the website, a simple, very simple website that I created and here is my uh, live chat pop-up. I'm just going to say hi and see what's happening on the other side. Look at that. I already have so many people. Hi there. And remember that I mentioned the canned responses. It's so easy to use. Um, you just uh, put colon and the keyword, hit enter, and you can see my typo right there. Good for me. Then, as I mentioned, this is how you can use it to multitask. You can use your, your pop-ups, and in the same time, you can go into your help desk, see what uh, tickets you, you need to be, to, to be working on, and um, it's, uh, you're not locked down into Discuss, which... You can see you can also do it from here. And this is mostly for people who really have a lot of live chats, uh, a lot of, excuse me, a lot of conversation uh, on their website. And let's go back to our window and show you the commands that I mentioned. It's, as you can see, help is, you can create a help desk a a ticket if somebody has an issue directly from your conversation, it will copy your conversation. If the client is signed in into his uh, user, that will be automatically populated. If not, you have to do it for them. But what's great about this is that they do not have to send you an email and do the effort all over again to describe their issue. Their issue is already in the conversation, copied there, and somebody will follow up with them. Secondly, if you click history, you can see the pages that have been with. So that also helps you to understand what has the user been looking at so that you understand better his questions. Sometimes it's not that clear. Um, and one of my favorite ones is LEAD, the integration with CRM. As I was saying, it's a great uh, resource to create your leads. And I'm just going to say potential client and hit enter from here directly. I can create the leads. I fill in the information. The conversation is here. And then pass it on to your sales team. So this is uh, one of my favorite features, obviously, uh, from it. And um, I will. The social media part, which the same thing, the, you can see your visitors here. And as I was mentioning, now you have a new route to reach out to your um, visitors. If the person has not started chatting with you, you can do it from your side. So it's a, a step forward to see, OK, uh, how can I help you? Um, do you have any questions about our product? And a lot of people you know, will like this uh, approach because you know maybe they didn't even notice your live chat or they minimized it and you can directly talk to them from here too. The same visitors that you have the, in the menu in the social marketing, you also have it in the live chat. So you, see you have the same view. I, I um, am a fan of this, this new feature. And to conclude, I would say 
I think, I mean, by now it's pretty clear that it's um, integrated uh, with a few of our apps. It's a free tool for you to use, um, flexible in the sense that you can uh, create your own channels, put it on your, in your language, in your own country or the world or your the continent you're in, wherever your market is. Uh, you have real results and uh, from the point of view of customer service and also um, sales, collaborative and, you know, I think a lot of you like the last part monetized because in the end these potential clients become clients as a result of the um, conversations that you've had. And that's a wrap. So if you have questions. For using this on the help desk side, you'd said that you can create a ticket directly yes. from there. So uh, when that is created, is there a way to assign a person directly from the chat box window doing at user, something like that? It will work. Uh, it will be in the same uh, manner as and when I created the lead for the CRM, it looks, it's just a form view. You have the conversation, the history of the conversation and you have to manually do it unless you use studio and you create an automatic action, but you have to manually assign it to somebody. Okay. And then I have another question. <laughs> So in our business, our sales team manages the chat box yeah. and then they'll have to call over to support, say I have somebody on the chat box, mm -hmm. log in, have them share the window and then they can see the... No, I will show you right here. How does that work? It's, um, if you're in discuss, let's say this is our conversation or next one, I can use this button and you can only do it from discuss for now. Okay. So you... Whoever is, yeah, it's just me for now. I invite him. Well, I'm just one user, but if I had a second user, um, he could, he'll be invited and he can take over the conversation. Okay, thank you. Um, there's another question from the other side. Hi, sorry, could you just um, demonstrate the canned responses? Um, yes, for a of course. So as I mentioned, I created a few. It's just colon, and these are the few that I created. I just have to type or directly select, hit enter, and it's that easy. And you can create as many as you want. Note, all the ones that you create are visible for all the users. It's not just, they're not just visible for you. So everybody who creates is just a pool of answers that everybody sees, a side note. Okay. But it's fairly, it's, yeah, it's fairly easy. Okay. All right, thanks. I think we're, I don't know, if you have other questions, I'll be on the side. Thank you.